Hi YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today I am here in Oxnard, California, my hometown. And I'm about to show you guys some of my favorite places to visit here. But before we get into that, I wanted to talk to you guys about a little something right here around my neck. This necklace right here is 18 karat gold triple dip. If you follow the link in my description box, you can use the code TOYTA BAY for 20% off at Trap Hustle Grind. All right, now for what I know what you're all here for, the food. I'm about to head to the Filipino Center here in Oxnard because my friend Byron invited me to my first ever Kamayan feast. So if you're like me, you probably didn't know what Kamayan means. So I Googled it for both of us and it means eating with your hands and I'm really excited. So let's go. So we're here at the table right here. Um, there's food, there's music, and it's really loud. So I'm not gonna talk a lot because I might get demonetized. So I'm just gonna do a voiceover and you're just gonna watch me eat, all right? I wanna start off by saying that this was not a traditional Kamayan feast, but instead the chef provided us with his favorite dishes that he grew up eating along with the flavors that he thought would pair well with them. Please correct me if I mispronounce any words. I am not Filipina, but I'm gonna try my best. So, the menu included black and white rice, ensalada and pepino, which is a cucumber salad, along with cherry tomatoes and pickled red onions to just add the freshness to the rest of the feast. And there was this thing called sinigang lumpia. And it was my first time trying it, and it was so delicious. Right when you bite into it, the sourness hits your tongue just right. And then we move on to the Lumpia Shanghai grilled eggplant and this sauce called Ginata Ang Hipong, which is a coconut milk sauce with fried shallots and it was drizzled on top of the shrimp. And then the ribs with banana ketchup barbecue sauce. Now if you know what banana ketchup is, you already know that the banana ketchup barbecue sauce is fire and the ribs were just a fall off the bone tender. There were these little stinkers to snack on. They make your breath stink so bad, but it's so addicting and it's so damn flavorful and delicious. And then we move on to the finale, the dessert. This is the strawberry babinka. To me, it's kind of like a puto, the steamed rice cake, but it's more cake-like and less chewy less ricey and it's honestly my favorite filipino dessert mm, so good and here we have the aftermath of the feast and then there's my bubba look at him so cute all right y'all so after the feast you know my ass is still a little hungry since i'm here in oxnard i might as well just gonna get pizza at my favorite pizza place Toppers. This is the pizza that I got from Toppers. Ta-da! Oh, the table fell. All right, so this pizza is called the Hawaiian Heat. And let me tell you what's in here real quick, all right? First of all, there's pineapple. It's my favorite already. Chicken, ham, jalapenos, red onions, sprinkle of bacon, and to bring it all together, a drizzle of barbecue sauce. It just sounds so amazing. It's just perfect goodness. This brings me back to like my high school days. Like after high school, I would come here and I would just eat this specific pizza with my friends. It's like all of our favorites. So, I'm gonna I'm grab a bite right here. Mm. Oh my god. There's just so many things on here that I feel like wouldn't necessarily work with each other, but they, they come together so well. Like, I feel like the pineapple and the jalapeno kind of clashes, but it's like a perfect clash of flavors. The red onions and the chicken go well with each other. 
and then the ham underneath everything just kind of like has it, it lingers in the back it, it's not really that bold of a flavor but it brings in that little flavor to tie it together and the barbecue sauce just brings everything together at the end for me honestly mm. the jalapenos has a kick that's why it's called hawaiian heat and the toppers ranch though the topper ranch. I think I can um, drink this, honestly. Let me get in here. This is like childhood, honestly. <laughs> mm. You don't even need cheese you don't even need peppers on here it's just a perfect pizza and you know one more thing the crust they don't they don't do a lot to the crust at all they already do a lot with their toppings they already everything about this pizza is perfect they didn't mess with the crust and i'm not a crust type of girl and that's just not my cup of tea so this pizza is honestly my favorite pizza in the whole entire world all right i'm not gonna lie to y'all i'm full as hell right now but i still got room for my favorite smoothie place in the whole ventura county area blenders they have acai bowls and smoothies but today i decided to go with the smoothie my favorite smoothie, actually, the 50-50. It's my favorite because it has orange juice and orange sherbet, and they have frozen yogurt in there, too. But it's my favorite because I love orange-flavored things. It tastes like one of those orange creamsicles. Bomb. I love the 50-50, but a lot of people love... Well, when I was in in high school, Pattaya was popping. Pattaya is a dragon fruit. It's like this very intense purple color. Uh, they have that. They have the Pattaya bowls. Those are really, really good as well. They have the red orange, I believe, and that one is uh, orange and strawberry. That one's... You can also add like a boost, like a protein or chia seeds, like all those healthy stuff. And no, I know what you're thinking. Not like Jamba Juice. Just a little bit, but it's a little bit better. And yeah, 50-50. Blenders. So I know that this is my Oxnard faceless, but unfortunately the Kamayan Feast is not always in Oxnard, but Byron Bukow is, and he's the one that helped put it together. So hit him up, go to his house, and ask for some food. But if he kicks you out, you can always go to Toppers, or blenders and tell them Toyota Bay sent you and you can always use my code Toyota Bay 50 for 0% off and if that doesn't work you still tell them that Toyota Bay sent you because I want this drink to be named uh, Toyota Bay. You can find more of me on Twitter and Instagram at Toyota Bay. Bye!